Have you ever thought of driving a microwave? Sounds absurd, doesn't it? But in this day and age, where technology advances at the speed of light, the line between the absurd and the possible blurs. Today, we're going to explore a seemingly ridiculous comparison, a comparison between operating an electric car, the future of transportation, and a microwave, a staple in every modern kitchen. So buckle up as we delve into the similarities and differences between operating an electric car and a microwave. Did you know that your electric car and your microwave have more in common than you might think? It's true. Let's dive into the uncanny similarities between these two seemingly different pieces of technology. Firstly, both your electric vehicle and your microwave oven harness the power of electricity. They don't rely on fossil fuels or other forms of combustion for their operation. Instead, they convert electrical energy into movement and heat, respectively. This is a testament to how versatile and essential electricity has become in our modern lives. Secondly, both devices feature digital interfaces that allow you to interact with them. You might set the temperature or speed in your electric car, or the cooking time and power level in your microwave, all through digital controls. These interfaces are designed to be user-friendly and intuitive, making it easier for you to use these devices. Lastly, both your electric car and your microwave are powered by complex electronics. Inside each device is a labyrinth of circuits, chips, and components that work together to perform their functions. While you might not see these intricate workings, they're crucial for the operation of your car and your microwave. These similarities highlight how both electric cars and microwaves are underpinned by the same principles of electrical engineering. They're prime examples of how we've harnessed the power of electricity to serve our needs and make our lives easier. In essence, both are marvels of modern electrical engineering. Scene script. However, as similar as they are, electric cars and microwaves are not identical. Firstly, let's talk about complexity. Operating a microwave is a simple task. You pop in your food, set the timer, and press start. It's a straightforward interaction that requires minimal thought or effort. On the other hand, driving an electric car is a multifaceted experience. You have to pay attention to the road, navigate, and make real-time decisions. You also need to understand the car's various controls and systems, such as the regenerative braking or the battery management system. Then there's the matter of operation time. A microwave session lasts only a few minutes. You're in, you're out, and you're eating your hot food. But when you drive an electric car, you're in it for the long haul. Even a short trip can take half an hour, and a cross-country drive might last several days. And during that time, you're actively engaged with the vehicle. Now, let's consider functionality. Microwaves are essentially one-trick ponies. They use electromagnetic waves to heat food, and that's about it. But electric cars? They're more like Swiss Army knives. They can transport you across town or across the country. They can store energy and even feed it back into the grid. They can provide entertainment with their infotainment systems. They can even, in some cases, drive themselves. And of course, there's the impact on the environment. Microwaves are energy efficient, sure, but they don't have the potential to revolutionize our energy systems the way electric cars do. Electric cars offer the possibility of a whole new way of powering transportation, one that's cleaner and more sustainable than anything we've seen before. So yes, at a glance, an electric car might seem like a bigger, fancier microwave. They're both boxes that use electricity to perform their tasks. But when you dig a little deeper, you find that the experience of using these two devices is vastly different. Indeed, while similar in some ways, driving an electric car is a far cry from operating a microwave. So, to answer the question, is driving an electric car akin to driving a microwave? We've dissected this provocative idea and here's what we found. In terms of similarities, we've seen that both electric cars and microwaves are reliant on electricity, operate on a form of electromagnetic energy, and have user interfaces designed for simplicity. But the comparisons, broadly speaking, end there. When we look at the differences, they far outweigh the similarities. The complexity of operating an electric car is leagues beyond that of a microwave. While a microwave heats food with a simple push of a button, an electric car requires understanding of driving mechanics, road rules, and navigation. So the notion of comparing an electric car to a microwave is more a playful thought experiment than a serious comparison. The complexities and responsibilities involved in driving an electric car are far more intricate and crucial. So no, driving a microwave remains a realm of the absurd. But who knows what the future holds? Until then, happy and safe driving.